Hello, this is Rick Patterson talking to you today about how to install an under-the-counter light. Okay, I have uh, all the parts out right here. Uh, this is the backing, and uh, we're going to put this up first. And then we have the ballast that goes in next, and then, of course, the light bulb and the cover. Just as a precaution, every video that I do with um, electricity, I always talk about uh, safety. So two things that you want to do. First off, go to the box itself. First off, go to the panel itself and uh, find where the power is to uh, that particular area that you're working on, whether it's a light, uh, anything electrical. You want to turn the power source off there. The second thing you want to do is use a tester on the circuit itself. And I've got my little tester. This is my, I'll call it my sniffer. And you use this right here to um, test anything that's electrical. And so I'm going to prove that this works. And I always prove it to myself before I go any further messing with any electrical work at all. So we'll just take a look at this. Okay, so this proves to me that this is working. If you can hear it, it's tweeting, and plus the little red light's on, plus you hear the sound, that tells me it's working. Now I go up to the wires themselves, and I test the wires. So if I were to test this and there was power in it, any power at all, uh, my sniffer would um, find uh, the current and it would sound off. Again, it's dead, there's nothing, so this is working. And here, just to prove it again, there's my circuit, okay? This is dead. This is safe. Now we're ready to proceed. So I'm going to feed the wires through. And because they have wire nuts, I have to put them in one at a time. I found the area where I want to go. And now I take my screws. And I'm going to put this one in. I'm going to go ahead and put this in the back, secure it, like so. Now if you take a look here, I've got uh, several colors on the valise. I've got green, black, and white. And the rules of this game are always the same. You match white to white, black to black, and green to green. In this case it's copper coming out, and I know that's my ground. So the first thing I'm going to do is ground. And what I do here is I take, because this is uh, not a solid core on the green, I take it and just make it up just a little bit longer than what I'm attaching it to. That way the ends connect. So I've got that. Now I take my black 
and I do the same thing here on the black. Take my wire nut, attach this, and you just twist it on clockwise until it stops. And now I take the white and do the same thing there. Make sure that what you're attaching um, your appliance to, your fixture to, that that wiring is a little bit longer than what you're attaching it to. I hope that's clear. Make it a little bit longer because that way the end of it twists on as you're twisting because it's like a cone shape. So it's uh, inside. It's a cone shape. All right, so everything's snug there. Now, what I like to do is I will take a piece of black tape and wrap this really tight around the wire itself and around the wire nut, and I do this on all of them. The reason I do this is because I want to make sure that nothing comes loose. I've got the green one here. Do the same thing. Wrap around the bottom and then just finish up on the wire nut itself. So that way it doesn't come loose at all. Now we're ready for installation. Okay, all the wires are connected here and we're going to go ahead and tuck everything inside. There is a bolt that's hanging out here and I'm going to put a nut on this and this will secure the fixture together. Now we take the light bulb, and I'm going to see if you can see this. It's got two prongs on both ends, and right here it's got a groove where it slips in. So I'm going to take one prong at a time, one each side, push it all the way in, and then twist it until it stops. And if you can see inside, they're vertical. Now comes the proof and the pudding. It should turn on and uh, we'll test it from there. This has been Rick Patterson talking about how to install an under counter light. <laughs>